And welcome back. Time now for our team of the week from the fifth quarter at last Friday. It's the Laney Buccaneers after scoring 60 points and forcing seven turnovers in a revenge win from last season against DH Conley. The Buccaneers head coach Luke Little says the team played with more energy than he's ever seen. Here's sports director Jake Eichstead with more. The team of the week is brought to you by Advanced Orthopedics of Leland. We felt like we were better than them last year, and we didn't show up to play, um, and uh, they embarrassed us on our home field. We were really, like, excited to get our get back. Like, that's what we were calling it. We lost to them last year, and that really, like, just fumed us to come back harder this year. The tone was set on the very first play of the game. Junior linebacker Mason Wiseman absolutely stuck a Conley ball carrier. The first big play of a seven-turnover performance from the Buccaneer defense. Play a game and I knew we needed to set the tone, so I don't know, I just came out and hit him as hard as I could. It was wide open too, he was running right at me. So I think because we flew around and we just gave it our all and they couldn't handle like when everything's going 100 miles per hour around the offense, it's hard to keep hold of the ball. I mean, they, they played their tails off. It's the best defense performance I've seen since I've been here. I mean, they flew around, they played with energy. Um, I mean, it was just, it was amazing to watch, and it was, it was just as good when we watched film. Laney was arguably just as successful on offense. Sophomore starting quarterback Colby Little threw four touchdowns to four different receivers in his first start. The team also ran 61 total plays. Coach Little says exploiting the difference in the lack of depth between the two teams was something the Buccaneers wanted to take advantage of. They probably got four or five of their key guys going both ways. And um, here we just, we went as fast as we could on offense. You know, we got nobody going both ways. Um, defense flew around, got us ball back quick, and I thought it just kind of wore him down a little bit second quarter. And that was Jake Ike said reporting. Congratulations to the Buccaneers on starting off 2023 1-0. They will be at home this Friday. They will be hosting the Havelock Rams, and that game starts at 7 p.m.